We got DQ for blocking. By who? You. you. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. Who? I went you and Jessica. You and Jessica fucking buy it down. That's why I told you to pick up the pace of buy it. Out of these a no. long time ago. Look. <laughs> Don't be mad. That was, if it was oh me, my yeah, god. Welcome back, everybody, to yeah, the channel. We are down here, and guess who is back? Yes, I have been giving the okay back to race. Sorry for the loud noise in the background, but Gabe and Miguel are uh, talking about strategy because these are my teammates tomorrow. Rubens Jr. Rubens Jr. will be in the mix as well. He is also my teammate. I have, uh, I don't know how long I'll last. I'm going to be honest. I might last 10 minutes. I might Everybody last 15 minutes. For starting your first race back with a four hour, hour race. <laughs> Everybody's like, first race back, four hour endurance. Jorge, you're crazy. It happens. That's part of it. Would the you do it any other way? The best thing about it is that you can actually get a break, though. If it wasn't a four hour endurance race, you can That's true. So, the layout tomorrow, right? Four hours endurance race. We got five mandatory stops. I have four drivers. I'm not starting the race. I'm not the fastest one. Miguel and Junior are the quick ones. But the tires have to last the whole race. That's what I mean. So, yeah. will they last the whole race? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think they will. The MGs. We've put 500 laps on the MGs, right, yeah, but you you they've been, yeah, they've been up and down. Like, so we put like laps on, cool off, laps on, cool off. Now we're going to put straight. Non-stop, four hours. I would guess like 200 laps, 250 laps. No, right there on there. we do 60. 60 times four. It's not that, but we still got action at Pistol. Yeah, yeah, All right, so the guys are dumb in math. All right. Well, we no, just don't no. know what layout we're doing. We don't even know what layout we're doing. We don't know what layout we're doing. We don't have not spoke strategy. Okay, so, so put it this way. We are, what time it's is it now? It's clock. We are it's 11, roughly 11. eight hours before we have to be at the track, and we still got to sleep. Eight hours? Yeah, it's 11 o'clock. So anyway, we haven't started up the motor in how long? You Since haven't February. checked the brakes in how long? Since February. So we don't have weight down. Since February. There's people that have been there today, yesterday, These guys haven't done a YouTube video how long? Not <laughs> since February. Not <laughs> since February, so. Not since February. We're, um, it's, it's gonna be fun, it's gonna be a fun morning. This is weird, like, we're back. We're back. Man, July was like rough, like nothing was happening in July. It's too hot to be honest to race anyway. Actually, give me a second in here. Well, it's hot. I have been to the last We're time. trying to promote white knuckle racing, Gabe's channel. He's made some shirts. Ooh. They look nice, yeah. Ooh. White knuckle racing, yeah. American flag, USA. Go America, go USA. So, good old USA. There you yeah, go. Man, good American mate. What was the so, shirt made from? A shirt? Those are good shirts. Close enough. <laughs> oh, I see where you're going with that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, America they're, made they're, they're so. Their factory is, uh, well, not factory, but there's a shop of theirs in Jacksonville. Oh, we'll right. take it. So, made. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, please like, subscribe, share. <laughs> Scroll sure. down to the bottom, my channel will be it's on. Gabe's channel will be on, White Knuckle Racing, and i like to do a shout out to uh, uh, Star Racing for reaching a, reaching a thousand. Uh, congratulations to them, uh, awesome job. Uh, Miguel and I and Gabe, we would love to reach that pinnacle one day. Uh, we don't have a goal in mind, to be honest. We just, you know, just BS. I didn't think uh, I'd be 300 yeah. for the end of the year, and I did. To be, to be honest, when I started doing videos, I didn't even think about subscribers. I'm like, all right. And now I'm just like, all right. If you like you like the channel, you like it. If you don't, you don't. That's cool for you. That's like, we're raw. I feel like star racing are like... Proper. Yeah. Their intro's awesome. They're like the good old boys. Ugh. Don't take this the wrong way, anybody, all right? They're like the good old boys, we, you we know, family-oriented. It's a good family. It's great. It's yeah, like, it's a great family-oriented channel, and they do an amazing job. But we're like raw, down-to-earth, like... And you, and you guys see the, uh, Bush the PG Bush version. Yeah, we... we, yes, we the PG version. <laughs> yeah, we see... The, you guys, if you meet us on track, right... What you see on the channel is PG. What you see on the track is uh, 
TVMA. So, you know, you know stuff happens. It, we have a good time. And if you end. want to watch a little bit more of the TVMA, just let us know. You're right. Leave a comment below. Yeah, you know, if, if I'm you being if I'm being too yeah. censored, if you want to see the real me, the real us, which this is not. I mean, this is yeah. us. We're real, but we censor a lot because I don't want to offend anybody. Yeah, man. But you still do. But I still do in a way. Beep no. that stuff, <laughs> man. I don't know the Seriously. beep thing. I don't. I don't. You know. What Leave in the comment name? below. Do you want to <laughs> see the real us? On top of what? On uh, top of whatever we do. Whatever we do. You you or or do you like the way we do that it now? He got another yeah. stick and he made fun of mine. All right. Moving on. Thanks for everything. <laughs> Moving Appreciate on. everything. Everybody else is on employment. He's buying new sticks. Can I get the hand me down? Yeah. Everybody's on employment. He's buying new I'm sorry, guys. Did but you, this is a long intro on? since we have not been on for a while. Has, does anybody have a transponder? Yeah, I got a transponder. Oh, did you charge it? Yeah, sure. Okay. So I did everything like I always do. What? Yeah, nothing else. So you can't even pick up a cart. In the end. Yeah. That's true. I still can't pick up the cart, but I can drive it oh, somewhere. Right. That's gonna be there tomorrow. That's oh. gonna be there tomorrow. In the end, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, comment. Let us know if you want to see the real us. That'd be good. Just say if you want to see the real, just comment real, and I'll know. To step it up a notch. All right. Thanks, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's see what happens. See you on track soon enough. Well, good morning. I just want to have that whole running ordeal. We just, we just, uh, we, we don't learn our lesson. We stayed up too late, like always. Uh, oh my God, these two are idiots trying to get the cart off the stupid truck. I do it by myself, and it takes two of them. We're good. We're done. Ta da! So, Gave me everything down. We're here at Orlando Cart Center. Miguel's checking things over. Uh, the cart hasn't ran since the first uh, Orlando Wait, Cup. I think this is my motor on your cart. Uh, That's because it is. <laughs> and then we go already talking trash. And uh, you know, Gabe, Gabe's coffee. I'm, Gabe's coffee. Coffee is about to fall off. And. You know, we're just doing things on the fly. We have zero strategy. Uh, we're tired. We just, we just, we yeah, we don't even have tires. We yeah, gotta, we gotta buy some tires because uh, those won't last at all. They shouldn't be lasting now, but you know, we're still sending it pretty good. Oh. And uh, you know, thanks for everybody that subscribed. Hope you guys enjoy this video and uh, <laughs> and uh, you know. This is gonna be more of a collab, collab video. Yeah, because I don't. It's gonna be hard to make two videos for one race when we're all together. Oh my so. god, Gabe! It's fuck. Yeah, go follow White Knuckle Racing. Uh, if you guys like his channel, you know, give it a thumbs like. I'll leave the description and the and uh, I'll leave a link in the description below. Now I feel like I'm, I've been out of it. You know, I can't even talk right. So. Are you taking uh, this with us? Yeah, I mean, I bought fuel for no reason apparently. So. Uh, yeah. In the truck. We're just gonna send it. So I've gone over. Most of the bolts on the cart started up, nothing fell off. Just got to check in the valves, make sure they're good, set and tight. Uh, Miguel's work on the tires with Gabe. They've been gone for a really long time. Those are probably the two worst guys to send out to get tires. But uh, we'll be ready. We're ready to go. It's going to be exciting. Good competition out here. Really good competition. But it's a long race. You know how these things are. Stay clean the whole way. Don't break anything. And uh, don't crash. Practice has started. And we are nowhere near the uh, ready. Because these rims don't like to pop the new MG tires. Um, this is the real reason why I never put tires on. Because they don't pop. Funny a little late, that's all. Oh, so here we're watching the F1 race since we couldn't get out to practice because we can't get the tire to pop still after I'm with 40 minutes of trying. 
So we're laying the sun, heat it up. We're uh, trying another compressor out. Hopefully soon we get the uh, the tire to pop. But yeah, zero practice, zero qualifying. Now it's time to go race. I hope nothing falls off. All right, so we are pre-race. Or he's doing a valve adjustment right before the race. Uh, I had a little bit of a struggle popping one of the tires. We probably took, what, 30, 45 minutes to get that thing to pop. So we're all already blown up before the race. All sweaty, all of us. We completely missed qualifying. So we're going to start from the back, see how we do. And uh, we're going to rock and roll. So we got two minutes and uh, cart's still not ready. It's okay, it happens. That's why we do this for fun. That's how it always starts, but uh, usually it doesn't finish like that. So. SLA Rosie, the freshman. Second to the dogs, red line. Mark is left field. Go for it. Euro Carlos, Kimmy Boyd, and Tom Jones. Why did I be left field? Because I just thought of that. Going into the garage, let's talk about it. Get here and think about it. Yeah, so it's like a man. That's what happens when you get the number one driver complex. Yeah, yeah. I, I never had that complex. You, what? I'm not. I just, I don't, I don't have it. Don't just start because stuff on your cart falls off. No, it doesn't. Yeah, it does. What? No, unless I get rammed. No, no, stuff on your cart falls off. I've never had any So this is all day. And it'll continue all day for the next four hours. So Hugo's car, man, we're just having issues left and right. But we got all car on track, and then we're gonna see what's up. Uh, Miguel's gonna start off the race. We haven't qualified. He needs to scrub in the tires the best we can, and hopefully uh, it all works out well and uh, we pull off some decent laps in the end. Uh, it should be a fun race. Uh, Miguel hopefully remembers the sign of when we come in and stuff. I thought we were gonna have a tire advantage, but uh, I'm guessing not. I'm guessing everybody went into the tires. So. We'll see. If nothing falls off the cart, if nothing falls off the cart, we have a chance to win. If nothing falls off the cart. Hit, hit the throttle, then jump in. So Miguel's never done a running standing start, so he wanted to start the race off and he thought he was the quickest driver from the group. I don't know why he decided to grab the gas pedal. I was telling him the whole time, put your foot on the gas and jump in. But man, did we get a good start all right off the bat. Um, he was moving automatically. So we were up to P3 in no time. It was a great start. Um, <laughs> quickly he moved up. Uh, you're gonna see a cart pass here pretty soon. So there's three carts on track at the same time There's the LO206s, there's the Speedies, and there's the Reynolds. Uh, three different speeds uh, By the end of the race the Speedies uh, tires had worn down. They were running about the same lap times as us But they had pulled out. They were about three seconds a lap faster at the beginning of the race Or two and a half laps. There he goes uh, There's one of the Speedy guys just blowing by the group and then the Reynolds made the, the, the racing interesting. There was no incidents between the Reynolds and us and the Speedies and anything. It's just, you just had to be patient, pick your passes. They really tell you how to pass, cart control. Uh, I love the layout. Other people don't, you know. People say it's dangerous, but to be honest, I stand by 
it's more dangerous in a sprint race at times than doing this type of race because really I don't think there is one accident other than Gabe running to the wall by himself um, that caused any issues. So by this time, Miguel's already having brake issues. That's the one thing I forgot to, to uh, check and I take full responsibility. Uh, I've been having brake issues from time to time, like air will get in the line, but it just gets into one of the calipers. It doesn't get to both. So at the beginning of the race, he had some brakes. Uh, Miguel really doesn't use brakes at this track, to be honest. Uh, I don't use brakes either. There's like two braking zones for us that we really have to use the brakes. And then when we're following someone, of course, you got to be on the brakes. So you'll see uh, he's already signing us and waving us that he's mad that when he puts his foot down, he barely has any brakes. Uh, so he really couldn't push as hard as he wanted to. And uh, he wasn't one happy camper. And uh, Miguel gets frustrated extremely easy. <laughs> so so when things aren't going his way, he uh, he gets mad pretty quick. But he's following the 206. He's pushing Bois, uh, the 17 there from uh, Bushnell. They're in a the VLR. The one uh, win the race at the moment is in uh, Tony Kart. Uh, there was a good battle up ahead. Uh, you know, he was just doing his thing, trying to buy some time, uh, try to get a good run. Uh, he, 206 actually pushed away. The one that was leading pushed away, and then Miguel worked with the 17 to chase him back down. So overall, it was a, it was interesting battle. And then when I saw Miguel focusing on the brakes instead, I was like, well, you know, just ride it out as long as you can until you until you give up and come in because uh really i was hoping he would stay out there the whole his whole stint because i really didn't want to hear him complain because honestly yeah that's something i should have checked to begin with um here you can see the rental car uh the 27 got by us and then he he takes the short crack short track around uh <laughs> does the jump through the curve um surprise that curve man if you hit it the wrong it's it's bad so surprise there was no issues no damages when that happened uh but yeah miguel's falling back here uh, he's able to chase them back down he lets the 27 by here in a second and he follows him around the track uh he did a really good job to be honest you know a really really good job with the minimum you know breaking that he had uh, and uh you know that was just on me <laughs> I, just, I should check the brakes prior to uh to the race but you know th things happen uh and then the uh rental cars gang around them you just had to be a little patient but it made the racing really fun and interesting uh here they go and split the carts uh it was just i mean the whole i think this is just a good great way to I, I really enjoy it to be this is the way I started this is the way I got into it I was one of the rental guys and then I would we would race against the, the speedy carts when they had a lot more speedies and then I wanted to move up as well so I think it was a great 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 way so a bit of a hectic start for us to the race uh, Miguel goes out put about three laps in starts complaining about his brakes uh, shortly after that about six laps later so not around lap 10 completely lost brakes so we had to come in we took probably a six or seven minute pit stop which obviously in an endurance race is something you don't want to do uh, they have a minimum of five four minute pit stops so that's what everybody came for and uh, we go back uh, out of the top 10 but we threw Jorge in the car remember he hasn't driven in I don't know three four months and I believe right now we might have the fastest lap in the 104 so he's cooking he's flying I believe I'm going to go next in the car here pretty soon and uh, see what we can do right now. We moved up to, I believe, fifth or sixth place, so we're coming. We're going to need a lot of luck, but uh, hopefully we can do it. Oh man, it's a little bit over an hour already and uh, we're all already exhausted, so let's see what we do. So like Gabe said, Miguel's already complained. Like I said earlier in the video, uh, he did a really good job trying to hold everybody back. Uh, it was just too much as uh, you, you see here uh, he was able to work with the 27 and catch up to the group uh, Miguel was still making passes and pushing hard as he could uh, finds himself back in the third place uh, 27 was really moving 
Uh, 206 is doing a great job fending off for the lead. Uh, you know how you get side by side, but this was a long race, and I was trying to <clears throat> basically tell, like, from the sideline, you know, take it easy, calm down. This is 15 minutes in, uh, and we still got three hours and some change left. Let's uh, take care of the equipment. Let's uh, try, <laughs> try to do the best we can. Uh, here, I would have stayed in it, but Miguel backed out. But uh, I would have I stayed in there and rode the inside lane and made it, made it really interesting. Um, it was really fun to watch the battles. Uh, I was itching to get in the cart, but I was not itching to, to see Miguel after he got out of the cart. There he is, pumping the brakes like crazy. He uh, he doesn't have anything. He he doesn't have anything at this point in time. There was there is nothing there. Uh, there was nothing there after lap three. So he was doing the best he could, hanging on for dear life. Uh, he was doing a great job you know lap times look really really good even even with the issues that he was having um it's just here everything gets a little crazy and hectic and then finally when when enough was enough he he was going to pull off sooner or later i know he was he was letting us know ahead of time that he was not happy uh 27 again gets by him uh, that was a really good battle to watch. Uh, 27 actually ended up winning the race. Congratulations to them. They did a really good job. Uh, overall, great, great race. Um, here, the this is what I like. The, the rental carts made the it, interesting. The 108 gets behind, uh, by Miguel. Miguel starts pushing him for a while. And uh, right here, you could tell he's starting to, you know, just lose it. But it looked like, I don't know what was happening. He, I just just trying to slow down but couldn't uh the 51 that's a speedy that gets by him uh it was a really good battle it was i mean it was crazy to watch of how hard these guys were going so early in the run it was insane like i was watching i was like holy crap like they were racing like this was a sprint race they were going three wide deep into the turns like banging it out i was like what is going on here uh rubens gets by miguel <laughs> And then this is what I like about Rubens. Rubens is just, you know, he's just chilling. Uh, I mean, he's still, like, he came, he, he started in the back. He start, started pushing a little harder towards the end. But I like I like this right here. Rubens is like, okay, you know, let me get up here real quick. And let me just give a sign to everyone just to chill out. Let's calm down. Let's, you know, it's a long way to go. <laughs> it was just funny. Like, Rubens, he comes in, he's like, okay, let's, let's, let's take it easy. Because uh, this is getting pretty hectic. So... It was uh, extremely funny to see uh, when I was watching the video and going through these, and uh, it was just funny to see Rubens, you know, s slide up in there. And he's like, "All right, everybody, calm down. Let's get a little break." And uh, here they they had calmed down, but you know, this is where Miguel was really hot after this because he felt horrible. Uh, came into a turn and look at his left foot. He just starts pumping, pumping, pumping. Nothing, nothing, nothing. And just sends the 108. And at this point in time, he's like, I've had enough. I'm coming into a pit right now. Uh, he starts letting everyone go. Uh, 17 to 14, he ends up letting go. Hugo, he starts slowing down big time. Uh, he was not happy when he came in. Uh, so I've ordered all new brake, master, uh, rebuild kit, brake lines, fittings, the see him get the stock he can't even get slowed down so he has to scrub the speed off uh to get into the pits and then he was not one happy camper so here uh i was i was trying to get ready myself because uh, i was gonna jump in the cart now and then i was i pretty had i had a good idea that the brakes uh just need to be bled and uh refilled but you know he was not, he was not happy at all uh, this is the only footage we have of the race. Uh, didn't think about changing the battery. Uh, didn't think about changing the SD card. So sorry about that. Uh, overall, it was a great race. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. It's We got some good footage on the outside and, and what goes on during the race.
That's okay, we got four hours, man. Come on. We just started. So up to this point, Miguel went out on his first stint, did really well. Then we ran out of brakes. I took over in the second stint, made it back up to second overall after we lost a minute and a half in the pits. Gabe goes out. And Gabe pulled the Gabe. So now we're fighting back. Junior went out there with uh, a bent tie rod for a while. Came in, we swapped tie rod ends. We've lost a total of like three minutes in the pits. Uh, I think we are fifth overall. So we're gonna see if we're able to keep fighting back and uh, stay in the top five. We just got one more pit. That's it. Should be good. He's tired, but it's an awesome job. He goes out there killing it, putting out some good lap times. I know that much. So, Miguel's out there running around with a half bust up cart in the mid 105s with the same set of tires we started. Uh, the team that's in first swapped out tires and the team that's in third swapped out tires a brand new set. We did not know we were able to do that, but we're doing well. Uh, just a disclaimer that everybody been talking crap that Miguel hasn't gotten better as a driver. And it's, it's all his motor, it's all his motor. That's my car and my motor. And he's killing it. Same thing with Rubens Jr. So, all that crap about we're cheating. We'll take one out of the fucking box. When I say we're the best, but we don't cheat. And we know the big board we race around don't cheat either. That's why this 206 community is great. So, I think all the rumors need to. If you don't like it, give me a thumbs down. I don't give a fuck. There you go, baby! Right back to the brother. Crossing the cars. Miguel has got so much better on track, buddy. Oh yeah, Miguel and Ruben. Yeah. They're both, yeah, but yeah, they both. Our whole team's in group. I mean, we haven't given up. Like, we're still fighting. All the issues we've had, we're still battling out. I mean, if we finish top five, I'm ecstatic. Super ecstatic, top five. That's third place. And this is Austin Ford chasing him down. I'll be happy with top five, but top three even better, baby. Well, Miguel's out there dying, trying to pass people. Trying to focus on racing. Holy crap. Oh. Three wide. Oh, we just need to finish the race, Miguel. I, I, I don't need to distract him. Ah, he's crazy. That could have been bad for us. <laughs> Cheers. It looks like we're in the P2 in the end. If we survive to the end, I can't believe it. Oh man, I love racing. Anything can happen. That's why you never give up. Never give up. Anything you do in life, never give up. Remember that. Oh, here comes the checkerboard. White flag. Can't believe it. Through all the adversity. After everything. Four After crazy everything. Hours. After everything. Four crazy hours. And you go P2 is ecstatic. Ecstatic. He goes not even focus. He's too focused on the race ahead. He has no idea. He has no idea. This is all I'm like six or seven. Yeah. 
He thinks that's the battle for third. He goes pushing to the end, no matter what. You gotta pass him. I think he might try to send it in the black bowl and destroy a race. Oh, almost got him. Oh, can't believe we go try doing something crazy like that at the end. You have fun driving it. Heck yeah. Yes. Woo! That's a good job by the team. Good job. Now let's see if we're not underweight. <laughs> we're gonna play a joke on Miguel. I didn't see That's the last time I wore this fucking shit. Cut it off. I'm just gonna put it right Cut it off. <laughs> good job. Hey, good job, man. Look at the TV. <laughs> good job. That was a good run. We got DQ for blocking. By who? You. you. No, I did. Yes, I did. Who? I went you and Jess. You and Jess kept fucking by it down. That's why I told you to pick up the pace with everybody. Not in block. You just spin face. I use it. He was a. The spin. <laughs> He's so angry. Miguel's mad. Miguel's like, his face, his face was priceless. Oh, God. You want some water on top of you? No. You sure? Yeah, okay. okay. We got what? Good job. Me too. Me too? Yes. Hey, I worked hard for that week. Yeah, heck yeah, man. I, I, I made a comment in the video that everybody thought you were cheating, but you were fast as heck in my own cart. <laughs> what? What is it? Tight? The car was great. It was really good. Drive, almost drives like mine. Awesome. Good to hear. Awesome performance. Congratulations to everybody else. We made it. Awesome job to the 2017. Awesome job to 102. Rubens. Also, draw two other teams. Coming second place, thank you for the support, 092. TV Boy! Woo! That's you, who's my TV Boy? TV Boy! We let the guy with the bad back go first. Damn. Are they coming or are they coming? We're coming, we're coming. Yeah. Hey, y'all drunk already? They drive them to the walk. Maybe we need a wheelchair for you. Yeah, guys. Thank you. Already beer in the hand. Oh, oh help him up. Yeah, help fresh out of surgery. Help fresh out of surgery. Yeah. Help him up. Uh, I'm trying to help. Uh, help him up. Uh, uh, help him up. Swap. Jesus. And your winner, number 027. They used to be the freshmen. Now they're the seniors. The freshmen. It finally happened after all the bad luck. You did it, made it. finally it. had a trouble. Was it a trouble free race? Whoa. Yeah, a trouble free race. I think they're on their age. They have to work they are on the right. <laughs> or have to they're minors? Minors? Do you guys even have a driver's license? No, you guys have a driver's license. Second place, TV Boys. I guess on a TV card. And in third place, on a VLR. VLR card, Bot Racing Team. Hey, the possible guys! Thank you for coming! Thank you, thank you. Good job! Oh, your dad almost passed out, that's why he couldn't get A little interview with the winner today. No. No, number 27. Tony Card. How they how they go today? Oh, uh, they're winning. It's good. It felt good? Yeah. Yeah? You wanna thank anybody? Thank my dad. Thank Sammy for being a great teammate. Uh-huh. And uh and the TV card for all the coaches. Yeah. TV cart for all that coaching. For moving out of the way when we laughed. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, man! Yeah, congratulations to the winners. Awesome, awesome team. Well, very well deserved. Great kid coming up. He is running in the junior uh, division, uh, SSKC as well. So, yeah, watch out for him. Pick up all the uh, notes from the truck. <laughs> your truck's not loud. No, yours, not mine. Yeah, because mine's not worry about mine. Diesel light. So, we got me too. end results. No thanks to me. It's tired. Exhausted. Exhausted. Over it. 
so like I said earlier, uh, Andre made a separate class for the guys that use multiple set of tire, <coughs> tires. Uh, I have the hiccups, so I'm not gonna edit any of this out. We're gonna edit that out. That's a BMW. Yeah, that's a BMW M3. Barely Vin runs. Buddy, our buddy Vincent. He leaks oil. Does it really? He just did the motor on. Yeah, it's all done. Fire it out. It'll leak oil. Look at it. It's burning oil. Look at it. It's out of oil. Burning oil? Well, well, it's out of oil. So this is the reason why these videos take so long because we get sidetracked. Right. I thought about Brad brought a break for car or bad. What? BMW guys. Now, uh, Brembo brakes are for cars that actually need to stop when they're fast. I see Miatas with Brembo brakes. All right. <laughs> so at the end of the AP2, no thanks to Gabe. No. Other than the call to bring him in and doing the. Uh, all right, so Gabe's trying to justify. That, that's the only thing. That After I bit the tie rod, I called him in so we can pick, we pick up the, the pace. Still or no? Did you throw it away? I threw that away. Oh, I should have left it. I don't know. Why? It worked for myself see? so I could remember. Oh my god. This is so dumb. So, overall, excellent event, Orlando. Great event to come back at. Miguel did an amazing job. Gabe did an amazing job. Junior did an amazing job. You killed it. Seeing you did an amazing, uh, was, uh, amazing job. Me too. Uh, so for a while happened I, today, and I was oh better today. Ran great. Just uh, you know, a whole bunch of issues. Tie, tie rod, no brakes. Uh, still finished second, so we'll take it. Yeah, we we still finished second to a good team. Well, very well deserved. Uh, excellent group of group of people. So, on to the next one. Orlando Cup. Let's Orlando go. Cup. We got some waxing to do. We're about to clean house. I'll clean masters while Miguel clean senior. If you guys want to try and get some, you're more than welcome. TV boys will be there. See you on track soon enough. Oof.